to my channel. Y'all are about to spend the day with me today. I am so excited. Hershey and I are shooting our 2022 Halloween costumes. I can't wait. Hershey has no idea. She absolutely hates this. But this is like the one thing I request of her as a dog mom. She doesn't have to pay no rent, no bills. All I ask is that once a year, you dress up with me for Halloween. And that's it. To me, it's not really a bad deal. And it's worth it at the end of the day because she just looks so Cute. Last year, George was here for Halloween, so we did like a little mini family thing. Ringleader, and he was like also a ringleader, but really like scary looking. And then Hershey was our lion. So I don't know if we're gonna be able to top last year's look because that was pretty fire, but we're gonna try. And I am getting a little bit more creative this year, so I'm so excited. Um, I'm not actually gonna tell you guys what our costumes are. You're gonna have to watch all the way until the end of the video for the grand reveal. But feel free to, like as we're going along, if you have any guesses, comment below. So first things first, I wanna deal with this hair, or we're gonna do like the first half of what I need to do with my hair, which is make it really small. I think I'm gonna wet it. Um, but I just need to make it small and kind of go away because we're going to be doing a ponytail extension. Am I going to clear it out or am I going to be lazy? I'm going to clear it out. I'm going to wet it, clear it out, grab a leave-in conditioner so it has some moisture, and then just slick it back in that like clean girl aesthetic uh, midway bun. Also random, does the video quality look any better or any worse to you? I'm trying something a little bit new with my camera. I'm learning actually how to use it properly. So let me know if you think this quality is looking a little more sharp because I hope it does based on what I did. <laughs> I literally just stuffed my head under the faucet. I don't want it to be soaking wet because like, you know, when you have a bun and it's soaking wet in the middle, when you take it out, it's just not a good situation like in the middle here so i don't want it to be necessarily super wet but i do want it to be combed out and nice and incognito i'm gonna try this new curl cream by andrew fitzsimmons yeah a new brand i have been trying their products like one by one and so far i've been loving like all of them yes benefits of short hair detangling here's a breeze Love that for me. So here's another clue to our costumes. We will be shooting in like a forest. So I'm looking forward to that. We're shooting around five, so right around sunset. So I want it to be like dark-ish, kind of spooky-ish vibes. I just love getting to be creative and like just do stuff like this. Ugh, best job in the world, honestly. All right, so we are fully detangled now. So let's get this ponytail pop in to slick. I think I'm gonna use the Camille Rose Curl Maker today. OG Fave for sleek styles. It's shiny, it's got holes. I'm gonna do that like double ponytail trick that we tried that one time, the last time I did that ponytail video, just so we can get her really nice and sleek and flat. I think I'm gonna do the ponytail at about right here what's going on mama there's a sketchy car outside yeah Hirsch, I think they're sketchy too what are they doing add a little bit of camille rose to this back part okay and then we repeat the same process and bring the top into the bottom and that's it. Hopefully the curl maker works well with the leave-in conditioner or the curl cream that I just used because that would be really tragic if it doesn't. I didn't even bother to test it. We're just balls to the wall today, okay? Hoping for the best. <laughs> oh yes, okay, no flaking so far. Wow, you see what a difference it makes when you actually comb your hair out? Oh my gosh. She's slick, okay? She's ready to go. All right, now I gotta see how we can get, oop. Gosh, some of my bangs are still too short to fully go in a ponytail. Oop, my laundry's done. <laughs> oh, my arms. All right, let me see if this can braid first to really compress it. And then I'm just gonna kind of tuck it under like this. There, that's probably the best I'm gonna be able to do. A little teeny knot on my head. That'll work. Oh my gosh, I look like an egghead. 
I also received this new hairspray from Fakai. It's a clean styler, flexi hold hairspray, but it's made with like this earth friendly aerosol. So I love that. And figure this is the perfect opportunity to try a hairspray. Okay, boom. So that's out of the way. My hair is half done. Now what I want to do is something I'm very excited about. I want to create a specific audio for... <laughs> Oh my god, the audio is gonna give it away though. Yeah, I wanna create a specific audio for my Instagram and TikTok videos for this. How we got to. I'll take you a little bit through the process. All right, so one of the things that I do, I have a subscription to a content like an audio platform called Epidemic Sound. So you get access to hundreds of like sound effects, music tracks that are non copyright that you're allowed to use on your social media channels. So I found a couple like Halloween spooky audios. Listen, like this is inspiring. I can, I can see it in my head. I can see the content in my head. And then we got a beat drop. Okay. 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 I love this. I downloaded also a record, a DJ scratch. Wait, that's kind of cute, that's kind of cute. Okay, and what is this one? Listen to how creepy this one sounds. <laughs> oh my gosh, I geek out about these things, I'm so excited, okay. All right, audio's done, content plan is set. Let's get started with this makeup, and also we're gonna get started filming a TikTok as well. All this multitasking, but this is where I thrive, okay? I love creating content. Content days are always my favorite. This is gonna be kind of cool because y'all are gonna get to see like all the behind the scenes content, all the thought and like effort and time it takes to put into these things. And then you'll be able to hop onto my Instagram and TikTok and see, and also the end of this video to see like the final reveal. By the way, if you ever have any questions on all the equipment I use to film and everything, I do have everything tagged in my Amazon storefront. So I will link that for y'all in the description box below. We're gonna do back camera. Back camera. All right, so before I start filming, I want to figure out, here's your next clue, red is gonna be a very big part of this makeup look. I already have lipsticks, but I want to pull in red to the eye. And I don't know if I have the right eyeshadow palette for that. I don't know. Let's see. I never even use them. Ooh, this could work. It's like a pinky red, but it could work. <gasps> Wait. What if I used lipstick? I just got all of these from NARS. Maybe I can use one of their lipsticks under my eyes and then set it with a little bit of this powder. Boom, boom, boom. That's what we're going to do. I also need to order something because I don't have time to make rice. I don't have time. So let's order something really quickly so it can be on its way to me. What is gonna be semi-healthy? All right, I'm gonna get Chipotle. Okay, boom, Chipotle ordered. I'm hoping by the time my food comes, I will be finished with at least my brows and my eyes. Always start with brows. I have been loving the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow freeze. I've stopped like actually laminating my brows just so I can use this product instead and I'm kind of liking that. I like to prime my skin with like a really nice juicy primer before then going in with the Danessa Myricks blurring balm. That thing is like magic, okay? If you haven't tried it, you need to. I know it's viral and for sometimes with viral products I'm kind of like me. Everybody's talking about it. I'm kind of bored, but no. The hype is real. For this, this right here, I wear shade 7. It makes your makeup look so good. It's like a bomb. But when you apply it, it like dries down to a powder. I don't understand how it works, but it just does and it's amazing. The way I am so concentrated right now. <laughs> coming out okay so far but i want the red to pop more we are slowly coming together any guesses yet lunch has arrived so i'm gonna take a break and just eat really quickly i am so hungry right now 
mm, mm, mm. oh okay that was delicious now i need to kind of speed through this glam so we can get her done here's the final look so i gotta throw on this ponytail and then we're in rush mode now i'm going to go ahead and quickly walk hershey and come right back and then put on this ponytail i don't like for my neighbors to know that i'm a baddie that i'm cute I try to go out there looking as ratchet as possible. Just, I don't know, in my head, like women's safety or whatever. Um, so I'm going to do that. Be right back. And then we're going to put in this pony. Okay, steaming my costume. Here is a little sneak peek. This might help your guesses. So if you're guessing right now, comment below and let me know what you think. We're almost ready. It is now time for my favorite part. The ponytail. It doesn't need to be perfect. It just needs to be on. Boom, how quick was that? Okay, it's time to put my costume on. <laughs> this is like 90% of the fit, or 80% of the fit without the bits that make it look extremely obvious. <sighs> Any guesses? This is so cute. I wish I could dress like this on the regular because like everything, the ponytail, the makeup, corset fit, like this is actually so cute. <sighs> Right now, I have about 20 minutes left to get Hershey dressed and then film like the video part of the audio that I did. She is going to absolutely hate me. I brought up her costume and I think she has an idea of what's going on. Hershey, you know your mama loves you, right? Very, very much. I'm gonna close this door so you can't run. Anyway. Get down. Good girl. Good girl. <laughs> this is gonna be so cute. I know, I know. Okay. How does this go on? <laughs> How freaking cute, right? She's looking at herself in the mirror right now like what's happening. <gasps> but you're so cute. Good girl. Good girl. You're gonna get lots of treats today, okay? Good girl. You're so cute. Okay, stay. <laughs> All right, I think that's the best we're gonna get. She's so on edge. Um, but I'm about to pack up the car with my tripod and stuff, and then we're gonna head out and shoot. Oh we're God. here. She's so excited. She's excited, but mostly like anxious. She looks cute though. Um, so we're here. I'm just waiting for Tanya to get here and then it'll be shoot time. I think in the meantime, I'm gonna put on my shoes, put on like the full look and it's about to be lit. I'm so excited. Do you have anything to say to the YouTube fam? She says, hey. Ah! <gasps> oh no, you did it. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a dear little girl who was loved by everyone who looked at her. Oh, grandmother, what big ears you have! The better to hear you with, my child. Oh, but grandmother, what a terrible big mouth you have! The better to eat you with! No one ever did anything to harm her again. Little girl, we do not have time for this. She wants to sniff everything. Come on. Little girl. Is she moving on? Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Stay. Girl, you gotta walk straight. <laughs> Good girl, Hirsch.